Oh, this could be brutal, couldn't it? Claw. No tackle, though. One tackle on a rotter. But no mighty blow, even. He's just got claw and dodge. Oh, God, his team's terrible for the TV. He's only got... Oh, God, thank God for that. That was terrifying at first. That was really terrifying. Obviously, he's got three strength five. It's pretty good. But, um... I could get Eldrill to break the cage and stuff. Just get two. I mean, 13 players seems like not a bad idea, does it? But could get just two apples to save my players. But he doesn't seem to have much much in the way of removals potential, does he? Just got to deal with strength five lodges. <laughs> Blodge. Blodge pro. Beast. So I guess actually the... The, um... Eldra would give us a way to deal with him, as well as having a 13th man. It just gives up two, two apples, doesn't it? This would be good. Could deal with a beast. And then get a babe. Yeah, it's a good beast, isn't it? I mean, the only thing would be legend and plus strength, isn't it? He's got stand firm. Blodge guard stand firm pro. I mean, obviously strength six would be better than pro. Yeah, maybe he's got a gun two apples, but Yeah, I guess just strength seven. Strength seven blodge stand firm guard would be the best, wouldn't it? I think. I don't think you need pro really. Um compared to strength. Strength's better, isn't it? Like pro's really good, obviously. But you'd rather have strength with him having tense. Yeah, claw claw would have been a very good one as well. Cringe! Yeah, I think Claude would be better. <laughs> good old, good old Robin there. Right, do I kick while I have a full team in the wizard and see what happens? I guess so. Did it save anything? No, of course it didn't. Ah, but then I guess I've got him as well, so maybe that changed it. Too many players. Now... Spread them out, maybe. Rog, Rog. Who the five? Let's go. Of course, it's champs. Only, only noobs play in um, in open. Um, maybe it's with a team called Bantabus Four Point Four. I don't know. I don't know. But, uh, <laughs> Playing and open, I just wow, I'm shocked. <laughs> That's pretty lame, isn't it? Playing open, you're a streamer. If you if you're new to the game, you can play an open, I guess. But um, 
even then, it, I would recommend a new player playing champs. You get more turns, what though. You, more turns, more time here? to make that choice. What are you doing? Uh. <laughs> yeah, he's played a lot. Maybe he's conceded a lot. Um, Temka, let's have a look. Yeah, he has played a lot of games, that's very true. But I mean, it's it's late in the season now, isn't it? There's, um, there's only a few days left. Like, he's obviously lost a lot, so... Um, so... It's not like he cares about his record, so he's, he's not constantly restarting. So if you're just going to keep one team... Then it's easier to play 60 games, isn't it? If I had just kept one team, I would have... Um, I would have played a lot more. 51 is how many he's played with that. He's got 4 and 0 orcs, but then 2 2 3 orcs. Isn't that weird? Nine of his 21 wins are by concession. <laughs> wow. Pretty impressive. I think the persistent teams is the biggest, biggest argument, yeah. But even then, it's just... It's just awful, isn't it, playing with open? It's a fucking cesspool. Fash was right. Fash was absolutely right. It's, it's awful. You might as well just not play play on open. I mean, you, like, Golden Claw first is obviously a bit shit. But when they get Mighty Blow, they'll, they'll both be completely amazing, won't they? Both are strength guys. And in a way, having Claw with strength is better because they're going to be fighting big guys. Of course. <laughs> of course, it's the shithead rotter that gets the cards. And I can't apple it. But that, that there is why the Blitzers are dying, isn't it? Because they're just getting punched more. Still going to need to fail every fucking time. That's bizarre, Destronov. You know, I had like disconnections and stuff. Blitz him and then block there, block there, block there.
can add four. So three plus dodge for him. That seems crap, doesn't it? I mean, two plus for him is bad. Elf will probably just die now, won't he, to the mighty blow blow. Beast is, is <laughs> much better than a <laughs> non pro beast, isn't it? <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> well, <laughs> yeah, okay. So, if you've got a beast with pro, pro and block, it's pretty good. Obviously, you could have just gone stupid then, but no. No, 200 inducements down the fucking pisser. Could have been two apples. I really thought about the two apples as well. Because the two apples, I could have appled that guy. And then this, this death would have been like a fucking bludger or something. And that's why I hate him. That's why I hate him, because he hasn't got block. It's fucking shit. He's 200k for a guy without block. I hate him. I absolutely fucking hate him, to be honest. But I thought I can use him to, um, you know, gaze... Gaze a strength five guy. But I really do hate him. Everyone's like, yeah, Eldrill's great. And I fucking hate him. I don't think I'll ever take him again. See, now here, Eldra would have been perfect, wouldn't he? Because he could just come in, gaze the beast, bolt there, and then it's all good. <laughs> I feel like I should bolt the beast. And then um, just hit him with a tackler. He doesn't have guard. Could fireball these four. Now the beast has to go down, doesn't it? And then just two dice in. God. Goes in there. And then Rackle comes in. And gets it. He blocks recovery. Tackle he does. Oh, fuck it. I 
fuck off. She's got the ball next to a piece. Fuck off. Fucking excellent. I guess I should have moved him in there. Even though he was giving up a fucking call block. Um, then the extra push would have been alright. I didn't even know he had fucking foul appearance. One D surf. Yeah. Seems a better idea. Fucking pal, because of course he does. I don't, I don't agree overloading. Of course he gets the removal. God. Bit of a dicing, I think, at this point, it's fair to say. No bash team is equipped for playing higher TV bash teams, are they? I don't think there's anything special about Nurgle in that regard. It's turn three. Fuck is this shit? And of course he doesn't need he doesn't need tackle to get a pal. Why would he? Yeah, Necro on the bash team, are they? Necro get the best style player in the game, arguably, and make good use of a wizard. They're not really like a bash team. As if he didn't blitz with a fucking tackle guy, he just blitz with, with him. I fucking hate shit like that. Like if somebody if somebody wins because they do the right plays, it's a it's a lot less infuriating than someone that does something dumb as fuck. Another power. 
Another armor break. Another KO. What are you on, El Mato? What are you actually on? Can you win 500 euros in, in open, can you? Or, or are you falling for the fucking blue pack? I'll just play an open but for reasons. Bullshit. What do I do? Five players left on turn three. Five players left on turn fucking three. God. Can't even push in. I have to dodge out. Dodge out one dice and get a favourable bounce. Against tentacles as well. Yeah, concedes do have a negative rating, yeah. Yeah. And um the other the other dark elf coach that Zacharel, who's top dark elf, he has conceded a game. Um and there was people there were two guys on the same points actually, they were first and second and they weren't on the same points and I don't know which race it was. Maybe they weren't first and second. But there were two people that they had the same record and that was why one was above the other, because they'd conceded. Mm. I don't know if it's implemented on the Blood Bowl 2 ladder, but it's definitely implemented on Mordrek's side. Yeah, this, this could be a concession, to be fair. Because, I mean, well, look, I'm going to get two chances. I'm going to get the one turn, maybe, if he comes back. Um... Go for the minus two D then, no reason not to. Don't want to give up claw, claw hits to her, that's the, that's the only thing. Yeah, exactly. I mean, these two, well, it'll be ten men max for the second half. Um, got a babe. So, yeah, it's, it's exactly, it's far from lost. Yeah, I wouldn't dream of, wouldn't dream of conceiving it. Nah, mate, I'm not going to minus three dice. Just to get mighty blow three dice back. Alright, now I could think about conceding. Now that the apple's gone, can consider conceding. <sighs> what, what a ridiculous match. Completely fucking ridiculous. 
I could still probably draw. That's the craziest thing. I could still probably draw a win. Five, six, seven, eight, nine players. Yeah, it's more than it's fucking worth in the past, though. Three plus, finally. Yeah, I gotta think about it. Gotta think about it. I knew I should have got the two extra apples. But then I would use one in the hill guild there. Right, three minutes to think about whether to concede or not. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. He's got three more fouls to do, which are all going to auto break, including this fucking bludge guard, mighty blow guy. So maybe eight players I could one turn, and then. Um, And then if I've got nine players in the second half, I could win. I could actually win this game. I could actually win. That's the that's the disgusting thing, isn't it? It's what's stopping me from conceding. Because he's only got one mighty blow. It's only claw is what he's got, which... Oh, he does have one mighty blow. I lose a fan factor, which is amazing. Maybe I concede when I take a perm. Dodge him to there. And then dodge, dodge, blitz. I'll just leave them all down. Just get fouled. Dude, you're meant to fall over. It's unlikely though, isn't it? That's the thing being hippie. Even if he casts everybody on the pitch, the chance of the perm isn't that. Like, the chance of perms isn't that much, is it? So, so I, I don't want to fucking concede. I don't want to... Conceding's sh lame anyway, right? Conceding's lame. Losing is... Losing sucks. I think I could still draw a win this game. It's just obviously scary without the apple, isn't it? Mm. 
can't believe that his beast went stupid when the turn he killed over. Plus this guy's very, very bad at Blood Bowl, isn't he? So I'm going to get a chance to one dice him maybe with Russell. Well, can't re-roll it. Yeah, that's exactly true, Royal Rimbo. Especially on Fumble, where they say on Fumble it's okay to concede if you've lost loads of players. And it's like, the fuck's the point then? He's not even fouling this turn, that's good, isn't it? Or he's fouling with a pestigal, which is fucking moronic. Like, he's really bad. He's actually really, really bad at football, isn't he? Fuck. He's fouling with a pestigal. Movement wrestle pestigal fouling. Idiotic foul, that one. <laughs> Giving up an easy 1D on the ball. Fucking minus movement killing us. Can't re-roll it because I need to be able to re-roll the one turn. Nah, it doesn't count as a free one. Um, no, I'm... We still count it towards you, then. Oh great, so there you go. Yeah, there you go, isn't that fucking brilliant? Fucking shit! Everyone fucking told me to concede, didn't they? Everyone fucking told me to concede. Someone's fucking hammering above me. Everyone told me to fucking concede. But like a fucking prick, I didn't fucking concede, and that's what I get. A fucking other player killed, of course. Fucking you was coming, didn't you? One kill back out of three. What a load of fucking absolute shit. Right, I think that's the end of the stream anyway.
Well, there you go. <laughs> Movement nine doesn't come back. Just fuck. <laughs> I knew that would happen as well. I fucking knew it would happen. Right, go for the um riot. Yeah, like, even on an auto-armor break, he's 1 in 18 to permit. On a fucking auto-armor break. It's fucking stupid. And I knew it was going to fucking happen. But yeah, exactly, as you said, the rational part. It's like, it's, it's literally a 1 in 18 chance on an auto-armor break, isn't it? It's fucking stupid. Don't get a riot, get blitzed on instead. I mean, he's so bad at Blood Bowl, I don't want to concede. But yeah, it's, I guess it's killed the team not conceding because that guy's dead because of it. And it's just so fucking lame. To concede on a 1 in 18 chance, you can't do that, can you? If you'd had a dirty player, I would have conceded. Well, that, then that's fair enough, isn't it? Because <laughs> the, then that increases the odds drastically. Your odds drastic go down. Oh man, but losing the one guard and the one man you blow. Holy shit. Yeah, but anyone can Destronov, can't they? I guess the, the idea is that he was probably going to win anyway. Um, and so that's why the, the concession looks looks better when he's probably going to win anyway. Exactly, saw the one. Exactly, you know, two thirds of the time I get the shot of the one turner, and he only dies one in eighteen times. And of course, the one in nine and the one in ten are not coming back at all. This happened. No, it's it's going to be chaos. And Dark elves are not going to make a new team. 
And I'm probably just gonna fucking have to stop playing for the day. I'm so fucking fucked up. I play um play Heroes of the Storm. Yeah, but the first foul was on somebody else though, Bleeding Hippie, and he didn't foul on turn. You could only make the, the third foul if you did a touchdown foul, which, you know, he probably doesn't know how to do. I'm so fucking pissed off. But he's just so shit though. <laughs> How do you concede to somebody who's so bad at blood ball? Hard to do, isn't it? I mean, yeah, you, it's true to an extent, as Bleeding Hippie says, but I mean, it, it was just stupid, wasn't it? The, the, the Kaz that he caused with anyone could have happened. The Kaz were like, um, were like what Inarian did to Muldrister. Um, nothing you can really do about it. If it had been against Ducky, I would have conceded. Because I know I wasn't going to win. But, um,. That that was the that was the sad thing. He was just so bad. He's just so bad means that I couldn't come and see. Him. Of course, he gets the power. Fuck off. Fuck off with your powers. Holy shit. He's played awful, man. Come on, he gave up an easy, ridiculously easy bolt turnover. Hasn't protected the ball at all. And he caught, removed about six players on turn three. No, nah, no, he's played terrible. He's, he's played terrible, man. <laughs> but he hasn't he hasn't gone for any, any crazy plays. Um... Fuck off, you cocksucker! Jesus fucking Christ! Oh. It's pretty easy when every block you make is a fucking power and removal, isn't it?
so there's no dodge apart from there so I think it's a blitz from her 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, G, 5 No, he's played terribly, Carlo Ancelotti. He he gave the he gave I don't know if you've all been watching the entire game. Oh well do you know what? Do you know what's easier actually? This is easier, isn't it? If you just give up the ball in your own drive for no fucking reason on turn two, I think that's qualifies as playing terrible, literally terrible. It's not going to salty because I'm. I'm losing my players have died. He gave up an outrageously easy sack on the ball. He didn't didn't think about the wizard at all. He just he was just like, here's my ball, and he got lucky that my witch elf caught it. In fucking disturbing presence. Otherwise the fucking movement now would have gone on and picked the ball, the ball would have been away and he would have fucking lost. Absolutely awful. All he's had to do is protect the ball. Because like, you know, that's why he's been awful. Because because the fact that every single block has been a knockdown or a removal, it just highlights how bad his player's been, hasn't it? But yeah, look, fucking hell, I should put rules in the chat, shouldn't I? Just don't fucking insult me when I'm getting diced to death. Jesus fucking Christ. Oh, look at that, a block, a powder removal. Who, who would have guessed? Yeah, to be fair, this was the weakness of my setup, and he hasn't played bad this turn. <laughs> Four players hit by the tents. Fuck. But yeah, his, his ball protection was horrific. I mean, there's no, 
There's no doubt about that. It's why I didn't fucking concede, because he just gave me a one dice on the ball. And if I'd used my reroll, I would have, you know, maybe he's knocked it loose and maybe he's not conceded. But I thought I'll save it for the, you know, the one turn and a two out of three chance of having. Maybe I shouldn't have saved my reroll. Maybe I must play down. Of course, I'm not going to keep the Blitz of Pedro Jack. You can't, you can't keep him playing. No, he removes one of his own players. That's good. Yeah, to be fair, there's a big difference between a rookie beast and a, and a bludge. Bludge, stand firm, guard, pro beast, isn't there? And his beast has been pretty amazing. But, you know, nearly, if he just failed that pro, the turn against Eldril, it would have saved me the wizard and, um, and saved Eldril and probably lost him the match. So, you know, he was, he was this close to losing the match because of the beast. Which is crazy.
Yeah, I saw it. I saw it. looked at a YouTube video of it. Um, I don't know. It's probably, <laughs> probably too stressful for me. I would want a game that I can play to relax. And I think Champ Man, well, Football Manager as it is these days, could be the way to do it. So yeah, I've lost and, I, and I've just lost a player because I didn't come through. But I mean, look, look, you know, the whole second half, he's done nothing, has he? He's just made some KOs. It was so unlikely to receive a perm. Oh, man. This could have easily been a draw if I made that one turn. Or a win if I'd, you know, got more guys back. Hadn't taken a perm. But yeah, I guess I should have got the, uh, I know next time, no more help. Just, just take that ball. Isn't it?
funny, wasn't it? Great day yesterday, three wins in a row, and then today a draw and a loss. Team dead. I'm gonna have to play the um, chaos. Jimmy has fastest turns. Hype. <laughs> Thank you very much, TNSE. Um, yeah, salt factor, exactly. Yeah, that's ex Carl Ancelotti is exactly right. That's that's the kind. It's exactly correct. Now is the salt level. Don't wind me up. That is the salt level. It's pretty hard.
Build a full trump wall. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, I wish I could see the ones. Oh, shit. so unlikely, you know, the whole second half, nothing happened. It was so unlikely. Oh, he can fucking die too, I'm sick of it. Fucking million five has fucked me a few times. He's fucking dead. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Back down from having a full team. The fucked. Loss is absolutely huge. Almost kills. Almost kills us. But I mean, the good thing is that I guess seeing as they're kind of dead now, I can carry on playing them. It doesn't matter that I'm salty as fuck because they've got no chance anyway now. Probably. It is what it is. Right. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed it, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe. And stay fantastic.